Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Selamat siang, mahasiswa sekalian. Siang, Sir. Oke. Okay. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Nice to meet you again, Febriani Melania Putri, Sri Windiani, and Nofraika Dwi Yolanda. Um, while we are still waiting for your friends, can you turn on your video so that I can see your face? Okay, Sri Windiani, all right. Um, how are you, Sri? I'm fine, sir. Okay, good, nice to hear that. And Febriani, Melania, uh, nice to meet you today. Uh, how are nice you? Nice to meet you too. Okay. Uh -huh. I'm fine. Okay, good, mm -hmm. good to hear that. And Nofraika Dwi, how are you, Nofraika? Really good, sir. Okay, nice to hear that. All right, uh, we have the news coming, Refika Rahmandila. Can you show us your face, uh, Refika? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, all right. Um, nice to meet you, Refika. How are you? Nice to meet you too, sir. I'm good today. Okay, good. Nice to hear that. Uh, welcome back to our class. Um, today we we have our fourth meeting, uh, meeting keempat ya dari 16 meeting. So we will continue our uh, discussion about the next one. Untuk yang conversation kemarin sudah saya lihat semuanya. Nanti akan ada uh, evaluasi atau feedback dari saya nanti di uh, khusus. Jadi nggak nggak saya putar satu-satu di zoom. -nya. Uh, kalau saya putar satu-satu di Zoom, we don't have limit, we don't have enough time, <laughs> ya. Yeah. Uh, we are going to be limited. Jadi nanti akan saya putar satu-satu di video khusus tertentu. Nanti silakan kalian lihat di uh, YouTube. Mungkin itu satu-satunya media yang accessible untuk kondisi saat ini. And Husniatun, I need, okay, I can see your face. And uh, Lavoni, Lavoni Trianggara. Okay, Husni, how are you? I'm good. Okay, you're good. I'm glad to hear that. I hope everyone is doing okay. Uh, all right, now we have uh, David Lee and Gina Paripurna. All right, while we are waiting for a friend and the time is ticking, waktu jalan terus, jadi saya lanjut ke materinya. Nanti link absensi saya kirimkan. Ya. Hmm. Oke, okay. so English conversation one, we continue our uh, learning about the next uh, topic. This time about personal life. Oke, okay. your personal life, kehidupan pribadi. Ya. Bukan maksudnya di sini bukan kehidupan pribadi yang secret. No, it's about uh, personal is everything related to your life. That is called personal life. Okay. Um, now I'd like to make it bigger for you so that you can see it. And here it is. Can you see the the slide? Okay. Can you see the slide, Rafika? David Lee, can you see the slide? Yes, sir. Okay, good, good. I'm, I'm glad to hear that. All right, so before uh, I start, uh, I let us say Bismillahirrahmanirrahim uh, bagi yang beragama Islam and bagi yang uh, non-Muslim uh, boleh uh, berdoa sesuai dengan agama kepentingan masing-masing. All right, so we continue our topic today. This is about personal life. Uh, kita akan ada tiga sesi kembali seperti kemarin. Karena nanti ada beberapa jeda, refresh sedikit, lima menit, lalu kita mulai lagi. Biar nggak terlalu tegang ininya ya, kepalanya. So, personal life, we start with this one. Uh, as you can see, I am still using the same book. Masih menggunakan uh, buku yang sama. It's a conversation book to everyday in English life. Uh, why I'm using this book? Karena pelajaran bahasa Inggrisnya agar lebih nyata dan lebih konkret. Jadi tidak lagi pelajarannya seperti grammar, vocab, 
Ya seperti itu itu sudah kalian pelajari di SMA. So in the level of higher education, I will focus on how you use the conversation. In unit two, personal life, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine subtopics that we will cover. Today, we will talk about uh, five subtopics. Daily life, favorite foods, personality characteristics, friends, and childhood memories. So you need to pay attention about this one. Karena nanti tugasnya juga pasti akan conversation seperti kemarin. Ya. Ini persiapan untuk conversation practice to uh, remember. Uh, conversation practice ini empat, empat buah nanti selama satu semester. Itu nilainya lebih tinggi dari nilai ujian akhir. Yeah, so you have to make the best of conversation that you can. Ya, yeah. uh, kalau nilai, insya Allah kalau proses prosesnya berjalan dengan lancar, insya Allah nilai saya nggak terlalu neko-neko. Uh, ya, yeah. that's um, five things. Nah, kita lihat uh, the next one. Nah, ini ada link untuk uh, ab, apa absensi. Sebentar, saya kirimkan ke kalian. Saya copy dulu. Stop share. Start here it is. I'm going to share with you the link to the attendance. Um, hold on. Copy. Okay. Um, did you get the message? I'm sending you in chat. Yeah. Absensi. Apakah sudah diterima? Okay. Link to the ad. okay good you can you can fill it out boleh sekarang boleh nanti juga tapi kalau aku lupa sekarang juga nggak apa-apa. I'm going to share screen again our learning for today. So this is the unit two personal life because we are social creator. We need to communicate one another and we need to have good communication and it is started from knowing about you and knowing about me. Yes, that's personal life. The first one, we start with this daily life. It's your daily life. In this book, uh, we have these six pictures. One, two, three, four, five, and six pictures. In these pictures, we can see there are two people. Um, yeah, two, basically, they are men or yeah, men student, male students. Let we call, kita anggap saja ini dua orang ini, mereka mahasiswa, um, student A and student B, or student yellow and student blue. Which one you like? Yang mana bagusnya kita panggil uh, nama mereka ini? Di gambar ini. Which one? Stu student blue or student yellow? Or student A, student B? A and B. Okay, A and B. Now that's that's better. Uh, thanks for answering my question, uh, Diki. Uh, student A and student B. Now we have uh, they. What are they doing actually? This is called daily life. You wake up in the morning and then what is he doing? This one. Student A, what is he doing? Drinking something. Okay, drinking something. You can say drinking a glass of coffee and then reading a book. And what about student B? What is he doing? Uh, this is a this is a lazy roommate. <laughs> what is he doing? What is this? Menggeliat, uh, bangun tidur sepertinya ini. Jadi uh, student, let's say student B just uh, woke up and then he stretch, he stretch, you know, stretch, menggeliat, uh, stretch his body because he just woke up. Yang student A, he already sip, you know, sip, sip itu kan kita oke okay, sip seperti itu kan. Sebenarnya sip itu dalam bahasa Inggris artinya sip me, menyeruput apa namanya, menyeduh. Nah, di sudah minum kopi dia pagi nah, sudah standby nah temannya ini masih tidur dia udah nah kalau di ini bedanya 
kalau di kita mahasiswa kita masih wajahnya masih bersih bersih masih bersih ini maksudnya belum merewokan ya kalau di sana mahasiswa tahun satu itu sudah pada merewokan kalau yang laki laki gender apa race rasnya seperti itu and we see the third picture what is what are they doing student A what is he doing watching the news okay watching good the watching the news okay so um, he is one of the ideal student yeah mahasiswa ideal watching the news always asking what happened today what is the news so and then what about his roommate this man or this guy you say what is he doing what happened to him rushing to campus i think okay all right now from these three pictures that's this a good answer uh, lafoni and it seems that he is in a rush that he was a bit late to join um the class so he seems to be very hectic yeah you know hectic seperti itu sangat um bidding around now saya cut di sini dulu saya kita bahas dulu kosakatanya ya dari sini nanti bisa kita lihat apa yang cocok dengan gambar ini we have one until 27 okay who wants to read this siapa yang mau baca silakan raise your hand klik tombol raise your hand Mm -hmm. Anyone? Okay, Lavoni. Okay, silakan. Um, asleep, awake, clean shaven, cram, difference, disorganized, frantic, groggy, hurry. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. So these are nine uh, words or vocabulary that relates to this picture. The next one, 10 until 18. Who wants to read this? Anggun, okay, silakan Anggun. Minute, mess, messy, need, organize, prepare, procrastinate, procrastination, put, put off, okay, good. Uh, we continue the next one. Ini sudah ada angkat tangan Alivia Dava. Silakan Alivia. 19 until 20. Ready, rumit, rush, self-control, self-discipline, sloppy, and prepared, and seven, seven, and tidy. And tidy, okay. Ini tadi... Ada tadi yang yang kusah katanya tadi yang agak agak apa kalau ini tadi oke okay, friend fine ini yang ten ini tadi nomor 14. Um, we have it should be read organized uh, bukan organist <laughs> ya bukan organ jadi kata dasarnya dari organ so it it becomes organized all right now let's see uh, first word the first word in here asleep it's uh, Yang mana bagus cocoknya gambarnya? Gambar one, two, three. Asleep. One. One. Good. One. Because this student student B is still uh, falling asleep. Any adjective here? Yeah. Awake. This one. Student A is already awake. Kalau ada clean shaven, ini clean shaven ini shaven ini bercukur artinya ya. Clean shaven seperti ini. Kemudian Yang ini masih berewokan ini berarti dia nomor 26. Unshaven. Di lawannya adalah unshaven. Okay. Um, that's one thing. And yang keempat, cram. Uh, cram. Apa kira-kira cram ini? What is this? Cram. Ini sudah masuk ke bahasa kita ini. Bahasa Indonesia. Kram. <laughs> Dari bahasa Inggris. Kram. Ya, kram ya. Uh, cram kakinya cram jadi so actually that word came from English cram nah ini dia cram kakinya ya nah this one if you know this situation you can call this this word frantic uh, frantic frantic means when you 
uh, when you think that you're going to be late and you are a little bit scared and that's frantic, you know, everything is going to be, I have to do this, this and that. Hurry, same. Mm -hmm. And then picture number four, which word that you think is suitable for student A? Student A. Which word? Prepare. Prepare, good. Fala, good. Student A prepared. Karena dia sudah prepared ya. Tugasnya selesai tinggal berikan ke uh, dosennya. What about student B, his friend? What happened to him? Look at his face. Unprepared. Okay. Unprepared. 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 Hmm. Uh, because unprepared. And what else? Disorganized. Disorganized, good. Disorganized. Uh, lawan dari organized. Uh, tidak teratur, ya. disorganized. And then what else? Which vocabulary? Mm -hmm. um, can you say this one is sloppy? Sloppy. Nah, ini, ini juga sudah masuk ke bahasa kita ini. Slop. <laughs> Pakai slop, uh, slop itu sebenarnya dari bahasa Inggris. Slop uh, artinya something slippery, slop artinya licin dan bisa tergelincir. Ini di situasinya ini, sloppy. Yeah. Uh, this one you can say uh, groggy, groggy when you meet your lecturer that you don't bring your homework, disorganized, and then um, procrastinate. You can say unprepared. And the next picture, picture number five, uh, what happened with student B? <laughs> it seems to me that he is having fun, but what is he doing? Here. Mm -hmm. I think he- Procrastinate. Procrastinate, good. Procrastinate ini bahasa lainnya suka menunda-nunda, suka mengulur-ngulur sesuatu yang wajib dikerjakan nantilah nantilah seperti itu. And this student, student A, what is he doing? Self discipline. Good, self discipline. Uh, and then self control. Self control. Okay. And what happened? What happened with this one? The last picture. Student A. Sleeping. Sleeping. Yeah. When student Sleep. A already finished everything student b uh, student b what is he doing he is reading in the middle of the night mm, so he becomes so i think it's uh, you can say messy or mess mess you know berantakan kaos kaki di atas tempat tidur ayo yang yang uh, yang kos nih apakah kos-kosnya kayak gini nih sama orang tua <laughs> kos kaki di tempat tidur so it, it is called messy messy itu berantakan semuanya nggak ada nggak tempatnya ya all right from these two students now the question is actually they are roommate roommate ini teman sekos namanya tapi yang satu kamar roommate kemudian the question number two which roommate seems to have more fun okay which one which roommate A or B? Number two. B. 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 Yeah. B. Student B. Right. Student B. And number three, which roommate gets to class on time? Student A or B? On time. Student A or student B? Student A. Student A. Good. So the answer is student A. Uh, and then, which which roommate is more prepared in class? Which roommate, S student A or B? A. 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 Yeah, he prepared for his uh, lesson. And which student is sometimes in a rush? Remember, in a rush, this one, student. Uh, B. 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 
Stream B, yeah, B. in a rush because because he uh, procrastinate. He has to do his assignments on time, but then, <coughs> excuse me, but then he keeps prolong it. He doesn't do it on time. That's what happened. Now this is going to be interesting. And question number six, it's supposed to be answered honestly. Which student is more like you? <laughs> Which student is more like you? Student A or student B? A. A. I Good. mean B. I mean B. Yeah, you mean B. No, it's B. Okay, yeah. You, you say A, fine, but then you know that you are B. Okay, if you are B, then you need, you still have plenty of time to improve and change yourself. Okay, it's not late. Uh, belum terlambat. You still have time to improve. Yang masih punya waktu untuk meningkatkan. Okay, so this is about personal life. Your the topic is today uh, for those who just uh, join with us. Remember that we talk about personal life, and the first subtopic is daily life. So these are the examples of the daily life. Oh. Ini contoh dari uh, kosakata yang uh, bisa digunakan di dalam um, dalam uh, berkomunikasi dan di dalam berbicara dengan bahasa Inggris. Uh, okay. So this uh, six pictures. Masa kata yang tidak tidak tahu yang mana lagi ini. Sepertinya I believe that neat, rapi. Um, it's not that difficult for you. Grogi ini sudah masuk ke bahasa Inggris. Grogi. Uh, procrastination. This is the verb procrastinate. Unshaven itu. Yang mana? Unshaven. Unshaven. Unshaven means uh, when you have grown up your beard seperti saya misalnya kan. Ada, ada jengkotnya, brewok, maksudnya kan. Check. Nah, tapi Ayukur, tidak, yukur. tidak rapi gitu loh. Tidak rapi itu maksudnya uh, berantakan, like messy begitu. Uh, it's, makanya, nah, oh, yeah. ini, this is the example of the Western culture, budayanya orang barat sana, bahwa kalau yang laki-laki, when you go to your class, you go to your office, you need to shave. Harus uh, dirapikan gitu. Kecuali jengkot saja atau kumis saja. Kalau dua-duanya, Uh, make make it neat, uh, bikin uh, rapi. Fine, it, it's okay to have beard, but then you don't want to make it long. You know, it's not going to be good. Okay, the next one, karena kan kebersihan sebagian dari iman uh, dalam Islam ya, makanya you have to appear neat, rapi. The next one, we have favorite foods. After you know your personal life, now we come to your favorite food. Everyone is having food, right? Including me and you. In this picture, we have four people sitting together and they are talking about food. So look at, this is what happened in their mind. So this woman, uh, let's say we, we call this person as woman A. And this one is, is it woman or man? I don't know. Woman or man? Woman. Um, woman. Okay, you say woman. Um, this is woman and this is man, obviously, because he has a mouse stage. Mouse stage to uh, kumis. And we call this woman, woman A, woman B, woman C, and uh, man A. Okay. Okay, the first one, question. What do these people like to eat and drink? So... They're saying something. Look at this picture. Okay. Before we discuss about this picture, I need you to read this vocabulary first. Kosakata ini dulu, ya. Yeah. And the first one we have. Okay. We continue to read. Um, please raise your hand. Siapa yang mau baca ini? Silakan. Uh, one until seven, eight until fourteen, fifteen until twenty-one. Who's going to read this for the class? Siapa yang mau coba? Anyone? Mm -hmm. Okay, David Lee. Good. Try. Uh, please read, David Lee. And then Siski Wulandari. And the last one is Romy. Okay, silakan. Romy. Um, okay, silakan. David Lee. Mm -hmm. Two. Appetizing. Three. Bitter. Four. Blend. Five. Crisp. Uh, six. Crunchy. Seven. Delicious. Okay, good. Perfect. 
Uh, the next one we have uh, Ziski Wulandari. Can can you show us your face, Ziski? Sorry, sir, but com my camera is so bad. I'm paying ah. to my mind, sir. Oh, okay, <laughs> all right. But at least I can hear your voice. Uh, please show me if you if your webcam is not accessible, you can activate your uh, profile picture. Okay, okay, sir. Next time, next time, not now. Okay, so uh, please go ahead, silakan. Okay, sir, thank you. Uh, feeling, mm -hmm. finger food, juicy, light, rich, salty, smooth. Okay, good, good, perfect. The next one is Romi Arif Shah. Uh, please go ahead, Romi. Can you, show, can you show us your face? Okay, there, right. Mm -hmm. Please read it. Sour, spiky, sweet, tangy, tasty, tasty, unappetizing. Uh, what about this one? Number 20, what did you say? Tasty. Okay, it said tasty. Tasty, yeah, tasty. tasty. Okay, tasty. Now, let me uh, pronounce each word for you. The, the first one is appetizer. Ada beberapa tadi yang kurang. Kalau ini tadi satu sudah bagus. Appetizer or starter. Appetizing. Ini pembuka. Bitter. Bland. Crisp. Crunchy. Delicious. Okay, that's correct. And ini tadi yang apa? Tasty dengan taste. Taste. Ng. Okay. But anyway, uh, thank you, uh, Romi. And we have uh, number H. This one is filling. Filling. Kalau makanan yang ada filling itu contohnya seperti onde-onde oh, itu ada filling namanya. Nah, di dalamnya itu namanya filling. So when you eat it, something come out of it. It's filling. Finger food. Finger food sebesar ini uh, sebesar jari, tapi dia bisa dimakan langsung di uh, itu namanya finger food bukan bukan uh, apa jari yang dimakan enggak finger food juicy light rich salty and smooth smooth itu seperti ini smooth licin dia bagus sour sour ini apa siapa yang tahu kira-kira sour asam asam good asam spicy ini sudah tahu pasti spicy uh, sweet Manis, ya. Tenji. Tenji. It's a tenji. Tajam. Asam. Tajam, ya. Tajam is bumbunya. Tajam. Tenji. Uh, taste, tasty. And appetizing. And appetizing ini maksudnya tidak tidak bisa dijadikan appetizer. All right. Now we, yeah, come, back to, we come back to these pictures. Now the, the first question is, what do these people like to eat and drink? What about woman A? What does she want to eat? Look at the picture. What what is this? Kira -kira? Apa nama makanannya kira -kira? Ayo. What what does she want to eat? With uh, chopstick, you know, sumpit itu namanya chopstick. Ada uh, something di sini. Uh, ini I think it's a Japanese food. Do you know? Oh, I was muted. Did you see my slides? Okay, all right. Hold on. I was stopped accidentally just now. I don't know what happened. Um, what does she wants to eat actually? This one. She wants to eat uh, sushi. See, this is um, this is called sushi, sushi food. Um, and then, what about woman B? What does she want to eat? I think it's uh, something, um, what do you call it? Uh, something sweet, smooth. smooth, yeah, smooth. Something smooth and something sweet because it's fruits, buah-buahan. And what about this one? Woman C, what does she want to eat? 
this. Uh, kira apa juicy. namanya ini? Mm-hmm. Juicy, good. Something juicy. juicy, sesuatu yang juicy. Or it can also, it can be an ice cream. Ice cream. Ice cream. Mm-hmm. And this one, what happened? Sweet. Sweet. Now this called finger food. Ini dia. Finger food. Finger food. Nah, jadi kalau misalnya kalau kalian pergi ke Bukit Tinggi atau keluar kota kan ada kue 88 namanya itu, itu namanya finger food. Misalnya ada yang bilang snack. Finger food ya bedanya dengan snack. Snack ini makanan ringan seperti ciki, uh, crispy seperti itu. Sir, I think you made a mistake with another. Is... Ah, oke. Okay. Nah, ini bisa it can also mean to unappetizing. Yes, is correct. Thank you for Uh, reminding me, uh, Lavoni, appetizing tidak bisa dijadikan appetizer, maksudnya tidak tidak bisa mengunggah selera. Because appetizer is located in the beginning of the food, di makanan pembuka. Thank you. Now, the next one, we have this picture. What is he doing? Finger food, tadi sudah kita bahas ya. Okay, finger food. The next question is, what are they talking about? Okay. What are they talking about? The answer is, of course, favorite food. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right. Mm. Um, question number three. Which foods are spicy, sour, sweet, or salty? Mm, it depends. Uh, Sometimes we can have sushi with a little bit salty, but it can also uh, be a little bit uh, sour. It, it depends on the food itself. Um, the next question, um, I like question number six. We skip now question number four and five because it's it's very dependable karena beda, beda negara, beda type of food. Uh, question number six, which foods look appetizing to you? Siapa yang mau jawab? Which food look appetizing? Maksudnya menggubah selera gitu loh atau tidak bisa jadikan pembuka untuk makan. Which one? Mulia Hesti, you want to say something? Which food look appetizing to you? Which one? Well, whatever, tidak harus yang ada di gambar ini. It can be from your daily life. Which food? Siapa yang mau jawab? Hmm. David Lee? Uh, you can say rendang. Is, does it look appetizing to you? Apakah menggugah selera? Yes, sir. Okay, good. Yeah, it looks appetizing. Uh, what about ini, uh, Refika Rahmandila? Which food look appetizing for you? Everything. <laughs> no, I'm just joking. Uh, which food? Which food? You, you must have a one... One specific food that you really like and you can enjoy it. Ini 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 lagi loading. Ini semak banyak pilihan. Okay. All right. So this. I don't know. You don't know. You don't know exactly. It's fine. Nah, hello. Um, hold on. Ah, why don't you say something? Lavoni said spicy noodles. Okay, all right. I like spicy noodles, especially spicy fried rice. Uh, that's one thing. And what about Febriani? What is your favorite food? Um, I think donut. Oh, you like donut? Nice. It's a donut. Donut with uh, chocolate milk. That's good option, especially when you the day is raining and then you sit. Somewhere it's calming, that's good. It's good. Option. I like that, especially when we are accompanied with a good friend around us having donuts. <laughs> okay, we move on to the next one. Before we talk about daily life and then favorite food, now we talk about this one personality characteristics. Okay, so many people in here. Look, personality characteristic, characteristic, everybody. So Each and every one of us has our personal characteristic. Punya karakteristik uh, pribadi masing-masing. That's why in English we call 
we have the word be yourself. Um, you just have to be yourself. You don't have to be someone else because you are already unique. You are already beautiful. You are already great. So you don't have to be anybody else. So this is the point, personality characteristics. We have these pictures, a lot of pictures. Where are they actually? Where, where are, just imagine where are they? In what kind of place is this? In the park, or, in the garden, good. in the park. In the open park. In yes. the, garden. the garden, no, I don't think so. It's not a garden. It's garden belongs to, uh, I think it's a personal family to garden, but open garden, fine. This is a public space, uh, public park. You can say that one. It uh, consists of many people that they can come and go to have their own thing right there. We have uh, how many people in here? Uh, quite many, more than 10 people, I, I guess. The question is, the first one, we have this vocabulary one until 24. We try to call next one. Yang berikutnya, silakan siapa yang mau membaca? Anyone? Okay, we mm. have Diti, Diti, uh, Refika, and then uh, Anggun. Anggun. Anggun tadi sudah ya? Okay, Diti. Sudah, Mister yang pertama. Okay, okay Diti, kita kita take turn. We four participant three. Yang ketiga berarti siapa lagi nih? Hmm. Dian want to Dwi. Read, sir. Siapa? Dwi, Dwi Dian. Dian, sir. Dia, mana dia? Um, Dian. Okay. Oh, Dian. Okay, Dian. Good. Okay, silakan. Uh, okay, we start. Uh, number one, affectionate, aggressive, cheerful, joy, determined, determined, energetic, extrovert. Flirtatious. Good, flirtatious, flirtatious. This said, this said, go the flirt. <laughs> and the next one, tadi siapa Arifika? Sila ka Arifika. Arifika. Uh, fun loving, gentle, inquisitive, inquisitive, introvert, lively, meditative, me melancholy, and moody. Good, perfect. Hmm. The next one, number 17 to 24, Dia, yeah, silakan. Dian, Dian. Oh, Dian, Dian, okay. Uh, optimistic, outgoing, pessimistic, physical, serious, shy, talkative, withdrawn. Withdrawn, okay. This is interesting uh, personality characteristic in here. Thank you, uh, Dia. I'm going to be talking about this one, but in the session too. Yeah, I think the time is limited now. Okay, I'll see you in the session too. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Waalaikumsalam.